The Azande Kingdom in Western Equatoria State on Thursday, 9th February 2023, marks its one year anniversary since its restoration on the 9th February last year. Addressing the ceremony at the Freedom Square in Yambio, His Majesty Atoroba Penirikito Gudwe said his kingdom's focus is on unity of the people living in the kingdom restoration of culture and building a society which is open, inclusive and free from conflicts. The Bishop of the Catholic Diocese of Dombura Yambio, Eduardo Hiboro Kusala said the kingdom will support the church and the government's effort in preaching messages of peace and reconciliation. We will put our hands to move with you to make sure that this institution is established very strong. The church cannot unite the people of Western Equatoria. The government cannot unite the people of Western Equatoria. Other institutions cannot do so. But you have the best gift. As a king, you can unite us. The Speaker of the Transitional National Legislative Assembly, Jema Nunukumba emphasizes on the role of the kingdom in restoring the lost cultures of the Azande people that was destroyed by the British 118 years ago. The king will not walk alone, he will walk through his chiefs. And above all, we need to safeguard the unity of our people, which he talked about it at length, so that we move together and support our government under the able leadership of His Excellency General Salfaki Mayadi. During the one year, the monarch have constituted a specialized committee to oversee activities and progress in the kingdom, as well as global registration of the Azande people. Despite the progress made, His Majesty Atoroba Penerikito Gudwe is yet to announce his cabinet. For SSBC News, I'm Emmanuel Patrick Yambio, Western Equatoria State.